Dear Charity Water, I saw your video on my dad's iPhone. I decided to give some of my money I have earned to give clean water to people who need clean water. I do not want people to die because of water. Love, Nora Shana Jackson, age six, first grade. Nora doesn't see differences in people, and um, from a very early age, she's been very social and wants to be in on the action. Nora is full of life and full of love. She uh, wants to help people and animals, and she also wants to live life to the fullest. So this is the guy that works with Charity Water that I saw in the video, and then this is me, and I'm holding a basket full of money, and then these are cups, and then this is water. I think it was my brother actually shared on Facebook the video that kind of tells the story, you know, of the founder and, and uh, his, his story and why he started Charity Water and makes what makes Charity Water different. She was really affected by, you know, seeing the little girls carrying the cans, and especially she was affected by the thought that women were breaking their backs, you know, getting dirty water. I think it's really bad to live with bad water. Charity Water has been traveling around the whole world to make wells and give people access to clean water. When I heard that we could maybe donate some of our money, I wanted to donate some of my money. So one night, I actually made that decision, sitting in my bed before I fell asleep, and I was like, should I or should I keep my money or should I give some away? So that I was like, I think I should give some away. And the following morning, Nora came out for breakfast and had her uh, little wallet with her, and she pulled out money and set it on the counter and, and she said, this is what I want to give to Charity Water. If everybody gave $8.15, there would probably be more than 1,000 um, wells in India, Ethiopia. A small act can mean the world to someone else. I gave $8.15 because I wanted people to stop dying. What if you gave $8.15 too?